work, work, work. See me have you work, 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 work. You see me do me dirt, 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 dirt. It's on me better work, 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 work. Where you walk, la, 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 la. I don't care if it matters, da, 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 da. Join me, I deserve it. Hey guys, so I just got a new wig from Best Lace Wigs. Here's everything that comes inside of the box. The style number is GSW129, color is natural and the length is 20 inches, and you get a cool free wallet. So here's how the wig comes packaged, just in a little plastic bag, nothing special. And then here is how it looks right out of the package. It's got nice, shiny, bouncy curls. Super cute, super cute. So yeah. It's a full lace wig, so it's got lace in the front and the back. It's a glueless cap, so it has the three clips on the inside and the adjustable straps on the back. So first step is to cut off all the lace around the perimeter. When you do this, you wanna make sure that you're taking your time. Really make sure you're taking your time because I cut a few hairs off of you can see. Oh, there we go. So now that I've done that, it's time to put on your wig, girl. So, I mean, I don't think you need instruction on how to put on a wig, but girl, you look amazing. Just kidding. So we're just gonna tweak it to the side a little bit to make it look a little bit more natural. Here's what the part looks like. Here's the eye. So we're gonna tweak it a little bit and put some skin colored eyeshadow to make it look a little bit more natural. Next, I'm gonna take my Equal Styler Gel and my toothbrush that I'm pretty sure I've had for the last three years and I've never gotten a new one. Don't ask me why. But yeah, I'm just gonna brush down my edges to kind of blend my natural hair with the wig. And I'm just gonna go right back into that same eyeshadow and put a little bit more on the part to make it look even more natural because there ain't no such thing as too natural, okay? Next, I'm gonna grab my wide tooth comb and I'm just gonna gently, emphasis on gently, comb out those curls to get that big voluminous hair. I want some of that Diana Ross realness. I think I might have been watching too much RuPaul's Drag Race, but that's okay because I still want some big hair. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep going through all the curls, combing them out, and it's, it's getting there, it's getting there. Here's how one side looks after just gently combing the curls out. And then a look at the other side. It's kind of just like, but I mean, it's cute, but it's not cute enough. So we're just gonna continue ripping apart the curls. Ripping, that sounds a little violent. I'm just gonna say gently spreading the curls. So yeah, you can do it with your fingers, you can do it with the comb, doesn't matter, because you're gonna still get the same exact effect. And so here is the finished product. I feel amazing. Now it's time to move on to style number two. So getting this style was pretty simple. All I had to do was add a little bit of water. I didn't do it on camera because I don't have a spray bottle, so I had to do the getaway in the sink. So I'm just gonna add some conditioner, which is the Hello Hydration Conditioner. And I'm just gonna rub that all throughout the hair. And as you can see with the product, it glides through the hair like so easily. I love it. So I'm just adding product throughout the entire wig on both sides and I'm just making sure I get it from the root until the tip of the hair. And now I'm just gonna scrunch it up a little bit to define the curls better so they pop. So your wig is totally fine like this, but I wanna add some face framing layers in the front to just take it to that next level. So basically I'm just slide cutting it a little bit, taking a few sections in the front and just cutting it in a downward direction until I just get it to basically where I want like there's no rhyme or reason to what I'm doing right now I'm just kind of doing it but it's looking okay so I'm not complaining and after all that random cutting this is the final product so you saw me go from cute and curly to long sexy waves and I'm loving it so yeah guys, let me know what your favorite style was down in the comments. If you like this video, then be sure to give me a thumbs up and I will see you in my next one. Let me see you.